double drag it. It's your boy A man. Just like it. Back with some new heat for y'all today. Like I never left. You heard what she said. Let's get it, man. Excuse me. Who y'all got for the Super Bowl, man? Put it down. I got Cool Joe. Cool Joe? I'm gonna go with the Rams. You know, you know how you had those like tools that you use for just anything? I think I I think I'll use this for anything. I like using this. What you measuring? Measure my fingertip from palm of my hand. You know, I'd be like, man, somebody tell me about the jacuzzi size. I was like, how, how big is the jacuzzi? 2 to 2.3 meters. Sorry. You gotta verify. You gotta see how big it is. Like, no pause. You gotta see how, you know, you gotta, you gotta get the accurate size going. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Come on, y'all. So are you satisfied? Like, with the size of your hand? No. Sometimes I wish it was smaller, sometimes I wish it was bigger. But you know, that's life. Gotcha. Same thing with height. You wanna get the you wanna get the small person advantages, do you wanna get the tall person advantages? You don't want the disadvantages of either side. What's a small person advantage? Um the kick the feet kicking syndrome. Not being tall enough to get on the the on the rides. Can't reach advantage? cabinets. You said advantages or you said disadvantages? I said advantage. What's the, you said you want the- Short person advantages? Yeah. It's hard to hit, you're more faster. Um, let me see. <laughs> I take those. What's what's the what's tall person advantage? I feel very bad. I don't know. Somebody, somebody should tell me. Huh? What's the what? What's tall person advantage? Oh, you can reach the top of the refrigerator. Um, you can see more. You have a, you know, higher height. To reach, really reach the top of the refrigerator. Nothing really is. That's all you need height for? I don't know what else. Besides just being tall. So that's 2-2. Two, two. So everybody that's, that's short, don't be complaining, man. You know what I'm saying? That's your height. Nah, but you Rock know, with that you know, shit. The world is messed up. You know, women only look, women generally look, majority of women look at men over six feet and high. They that's crazy. Their, that's not the woman for that's you. That's their preference. Yeah, I know. That that's is not, not the, the woman for you. They're, they're, they're crazy. To think that a I'm woman like, don't yeah. you or don't want to talk to you because of your height, bro. Crazy. You would you just made a W play because yeah. she wasn't meant for you, bro. Get your weight up. Leave her in the streets. Facts. Where she belong for the street. Women change your preferences. It's not a lot of tall people out here in the world. Something like what three percent of men over six feet. That's it. Yeah, pretty small. Really small. That's and I never crazy. I thought it would be like twenty two. Yeah, it's only six. It's only like three. It's only like three percent in America. Sure, dude, be done. Treat you like the queen that you are. You better climb that. Well, you better climb that tree. I know some of y'all girls out here tall. You know what I'm saying? It's all right. You know, me and date short girls all the time. We, it's all right to us. You just can't, you know. Just don't wear no heels or something. Mm. I don't care. I don't care, if a girl. I dated a girl that was six and one. I dated a girl that was six. Yeah. Sheesh, tall. man. She was like five eleven. Or something. Oof. Would I do it again? I don't know. I don't know. I just know it was difficult. And you know what's crazy? That was the first. <laughs> that was the first um, first person I uh, did car car stuff with. <laughs> a tall person. Who would do that? You would think I go with a shorter person for the first time? Oh, I don't know. And it was in that green car. I had. What? Yeah, I don't know how that. Was it possible. was a little spacious in there. Man, what? She, I think. That, that aluminum? Yeah, aluminum. Yeah. Gee, that shit was tight as hell. Two six foot bubble. Trying to do something now. Trying to break it with those. Man, it was hard, but we got it, got it going. You know what I'm saying? Gotta do what you gotta do. All yeah. right. We excited, man. Last episode, Demon Slayer. You know what I'm saying? I really thought you about to pull out a weapon. Nah, I'll just. <sighs> RP Ring Goku. You know what I'm saying? I love this. Freaking last episode, Tengen show out, bro. Like at first, I did not like him. Why well, I ain't gonna say I didn't like him, but his personality was kind of like, what's up with this dude? He kind of seemed weird. 
But as we got to know him, bro, he mm -hmm. quickly shot up to be like like a fan favorite, one of my favorites. Uh, how she was on the show, you know what I'm saying? This dude is cold, bro. Resilient, flashy. Yeah. Three wives, take care of. Make sure they all three happy. You know how hard it is to take care of one wife. Let's keep her happy. This man doing it for three. That's stronger than his freaking powers to me, bro. Hey, but yeah, time joining them show doubt. Zenitsu, you know, okay. And it ended crazy too on the explosion. Yeah, that, that explosion was like, right. I thought somebody else popping up or something. They ain't want us to die. No. We barely freaking get under the field. It's explosion. Those don't surprise me no more. Maybe in this anime, it's like, eh. If it was Muzan, I'd be like, ah! But it wasn't. It was like an explosion. Wow. Somebody, somebody gonna die. Oh, snap. Somebody else show up, bro. They're, they're done. I know. That's why I was scared of. Yeah, man, it was, a, it was a dope ending. Oh, well, well, a dope almost ending. Having everybody do their, like, special attacks. Everybody showing out. I want to see, I wish, I can't, I hope we get to see more sound um, forms from Tingen, you know what I'm saying, going forward in the future. Because having that chord, bro, that stuff was freaking beautiful. That was yeah, beautiful. So, that was crazy. hopefully to see more from him and more from the other Hashiras uh, going forward. I don't know how they about to end this off. And I'm already waiting for season three because I felt like season two was kind of short. Mostly because they had the movie in there, which is understandable. You know what I'm saying? Which is understandable. So, um, hopefully we don't do this again. We go to another movie and then that movie's happy. I hope we don't do that again. Just give us a straight season three. Feel that. Yeah. Uh, Shouts out to you Foldable as well. Yes, you know what I'm saying? Y'all bringing this beautiful story to light. You know what I'm saying? Y'all just blend well together, man. Yeah, I promise man. you, y'all blend well together. Showing out for the anime community. Yeah. A lot of people gotta that. understand, Demon Slayer has... I think one thing that a lot of people don't a lot of people get misconstrued is is anime delivering a culture a lot of people love naruto because of the culture it has we ninjas you got you got you got different you got different elements you can use yeah you got you got hand-to-hand -hand combat yeah. you get to like walk on trees you get to flash through trees it's a lot move, of characters literally move like you got headbands you yeah. got different villages that, that yeah. you're able to rep that's kind of that's called culture same thing yeah. with dragon ball it had culture you could turn super saiyan um That's it. you could be a Namekian, you could be a Saiyan, you know what I'm saying? Like it's 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 a culture. And I think Demon Slayer gives you that culture because you can have you know different water breathings, you know what I'm saying? You could rep for different people, and it's just like you a demon slayer. So yeah, any anime that kind of wants you to be in that world kind of kind of gets favored a lot because it's like inviting you. It, yeah. it literally has a culture. Think nice. about how many words that you picked up from like somebody else or or like a dance that you was able to do that you saw you pretty much like you know what i'm saying yeah. that's kind of like grabbing up culture so that's what i think these certain animes do and i hate when they get like kind of shitted on because of that some of y'all animes just don't have that culture yeah you gotta have a culture I'm not saying all animes need it yeah i'm just saying that's why a lot of these certain animes get this popularity though yeah and it's inviting and it's cold and it's cool you know what yeah. i'm saying so we in there i got a freaking ninja band somewhere around here i don't know where it's at yeah help that game it's here true you know, I put some money on that. It's here. But yeah, man, we're going to get to the season finale. Uh, bittersweet. And then yep. go from them. Dang, you ready to get into it? Run it up. Yeah. <laughs> what did you say? <laughs> oh, man. That was a crazy explosion, though. You remember what his sister did? And that destroyed all the, like, houses and stuff? Oh, yeah. Like, he has got to be, like, five times stronger than that. Oh, shoot. Nezuko coming in the clutch. Yeah, she be protecting her brother, bro. Oh, I think I don't think they showed it, but I think Tinkin and I got taken out. Yeah, that was crazy. Cause when he first got sliced, it showed it yeah, like sliced. I didn't him. think it was took his eye out. I was like, damn, bro, this man, how you gonna come back from this? That man got zero road. Take care of your brother, girl. Yo, kid Nezuko is just so sweet, man. Adorable. Damn. Now, where we gonna go for the boom boom room? Now, it's all gone. Look at this. can't have nothing nice. You gonna rebuild it. Could have went to go be a demon at a library. Go there or something. They don't come here. <laughs> the guy, his fingers was freaked up. I'm about to say, I'm surprised he could move. They gonna, they gonna be in that... Um, hospital for like a whole year, boy. Oh, yeah, he was, boy. 
<laughs> so this <laughs> He back. <laughs> Damn. Oh, yeah, because he had, yeah, I remember that. He did two of them God speeds. Damn. Hear him. It's making hear his heartbeat all the way over there. That's yeah. so dope. Freak! Where's all the um people that supposed to show up after the fight? Yeah. Friction no boo at, bro. Not enough time. Who got rid of Tanjiro poison? Do it for him. Uh oh. That's how he got she did it? Yo, she's a W. Go do it to Tengen. Yo, Nezuko. She got freaking healing property. Damn. Damn. Nezuko, come on. Because uh, it's a demon poison. She said, I'm never going to pray to you again. She said. She's trying to get him to die. <laughs> But I'll get to say my last word. Nezuko, come on. She like, what's up? I'm here to heal. She coming up like this with her hand <laughs> to everybody, but <laughs> Damn! <laughs> she trying to fight for that. She said cremated help. His eye, man. <laughs> Face back. <laughs> Oh, he trying to make sure. W. That's smart. Come on, I'm going to go search for him, but that's going to do all the work. Hey. Mm. That was a knife from the uh the other uh, girl. That was, that's crazy. I forgot about that knife. It's getting. The demon cat? I knew it. They argue with each other. Is it burning away? Yes! <laughs> y'all siblings, man. Love each other before y'all go. Facts. That's true. Tanjo Nezuko, learn from this. Yeah, don't talk to your sister like that. Mm. Tanjiro always uh, do a field goal with the, with the demons, bro. Graceful deaths. This man got to talk no juicy, fam. Go ahead, man. You know you want to cry. Better not bite off Tanjiro's hand, either. Dang! Dang, he called about her name for the first time. Wow. Oh, backstory time. Oh, dang. 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 My mama was out there getting it in. A debt collector. Thirteen. Whoa, what the hell? Burned alive. Damn. Sheesh. Muzaka. Oh. Hey man, that's, that's what you, you get. get. That's what you get. It's karma, especially not doing the killing blow in the first place. Mm. That's when you start saying "lucky you" a lot. 
Oh, yeah, I didn't know he was that close. Dang, it's like the sword. Oh, damn. You just finished eating somebody? Damn! Kind of hot it. Upper six. His eyes. Oh, that's the old upper six? Maybe he upgraded once they... Or did they replace him? Yeah, he probably rose up. This probably one of the people gonna fight in the future. Jeez. He gave it, gave it a pen. He got that, but. Mm. He was freaking spying, bro. Oh my gosh. He's trying to learn from his mistakes and leave you alone. Dang, you seen the light and dark compares? Like, yeah, toward the light. Dang. Woo! She want to be with her brother. I never agree with separation being the solution. Yeah. Dang. Wow. Wow. Shit, it, bro. Damn. This remind me of Rui. You remember Rui? Ooh. Demon. He was like lower three, I think. Oh, you talking about you talking about you talking about, talking about the one with the uh, the family, the spider family? Yeah. yeah. They did. Hmm. She's like, I know, I got demon, I got demon chat. <laughs> no, nah, don't say that, bro. Facts. This ain't been done in years, right? Oh. Facts. I need one of them. He's like, get back, girl. Lowly? Y'all ain't beat nobody in years. Retiring. Frick you. Who are you supposed to be? Ah. Uh-oh. The young guy, you hate. Mm. <laughs> yes, sir. All three of them going to reach their potential, man. Fact. I hate that damn bird. Hey! You seen him smile a long time. Dang, the blood! Couldn't, like, couldn't that's gonna help him out? Mm. He might be. It looks similar. Facts! During our generation. On my family. Man, I hope he's alive to see this, isn't it? Upper. Upper. That's a three. Oh, I knew it! You coward, bro! Goku's mocked your wings, bro. I don't like these memes by Muzan. <laughs> these be the worst memes. Facts. <laughs> he be like, alright. I'm like, damn, bro. <laughs> That's facts. Shit. He probably be like, hey, I got a couple parts left I can use. God dang. <laughs> I might as well use them before I die. <laughs> The four of them, the four of us. It's family, man. Hey, family, bro. Uh, that season finale was uh, me. It was me. It.
It was me about it. No, no, cliffhanger? No, leading up to something else happening? We didn't even get to see the meeting? It moves on. We can't see the meeting? I'm glad everybody alive. The poison got, you know what I'm saying, repelled. And, I'm, and, I, and I pretty much expected the demons to have a story. Yeah. So that was expected. Everything happened as expected. I'm thinking I'm going to get a little bit of something. Like Break the, me off something. Like the ending, like cliffhangers and stuff. I feel that. Break me off a little piece of something. You know what I'm saying? I'll take Muzar cursing them out or something. I'll take that. That's it. I feel you. We ain't got a, uh, I guess, a feel good ending in a while. Like a, like a just only happiness. Yeah. Um, it could have broke me off a little piece of something. I feel that though. I feel let down. And, and it's supposed to be 45 minutes long. So 36 minutes of just them telling their backstory. And then us healing each other. We didn't get no new piece of information. I can see where it coming from, man. The endings and stuff, like normally have that little pizzazz at the end. I can see that. I gotta I gotta keep it real, man. I'm I sorry. I'm sorry, Demon sure. Slayer. This was this was this was this is uh, boring. But I freaking uh, enjoyed Guitaro's, Guitaro's uh, backstory with his sister Yume, Daki. It was freaking dope. Like I said, it reminded me of Rui. It's like we're fighting these demons and stuff, and then we learn their backstory and how they grow up. It kind of make you feel for them. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And then Tanjiro just kind of helping them, leading them to get to that path of forgiveness toward each other. He's like the person that, what's that person that'd be like helping people like mediator? get to the, um, to the afterlife? Oh. Forgot who uh, that I is. Name Somebody that'd be like aiding them, like, come on. <laughs> like, that's that's how he is, man. Talk that stuff about was you cold. Too. That stuff was cold. And then Guitaro, like, like I said, I don't agree with people separating. Like, I understand why Guitaro was trying to do it. Like, she was more in the light and he felt like he regret kind of like bringing her over to the dark side mm -hmm. in a sense. But like, that stuff never really like fully heals the person. And this is something remind me of Kairos and uh, Rebecca from, from One Piece. Like at the end, he understood like, man, I don't want you to have this reputation, blah, blah. Yeah. That one was kind of, like, I, I can understand him leaving her for this because he going to hell and she she had probably had a chance to go to heaven. I can see that. But the Kairos and the other one. I, that, she that don't have a chance to go to heaven. The way the way it looked like was as if he was leaving her alone and like she she had a chance to like go to a better path. Yeah, but, but it then, was like already too then, late, they, yeah. then when she jumped on his back, they walked to hell. Yeah, like with all the flames and stuff like that. Yeah, so, I think it was just like I didn't think she was gonna be able to go to hell of heaven anyway because she killed all those. That's people. what I'm saying. I think it was just a similar like an analogy of like yeah. she started off pure, but he taught her the way he raised her, kind of messed it up, and he regret mm -hmm. that. But I'm saying like you leaving her is not the answer. Like Cairo's like you leaving your daughter Rebecca just because his reputation thing is not the answer. Like she want to be with you. Like y'all need to be together, be a family and stuff like yeah. that. Like you know. But that was cool. I just loved how that, all that build up and stuff was good. Nezuko, just cute. W, W, one man's. Just saved everybody. Like, he would have died. A lot of people would have died. If Nezuko, of, all of them would have died. Besides Zenitsu. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, all of them would have died besides him. I mean, I'm pretty sure he would have probably bled out because he wouldn't even really get no help. He probably would have died before this Hashira came up. He got snaked, so I, I probably assume he got some type of poison antidote, but I don't know if, it, if he had something for like the demon poison. Yeah, I think it was more so him just providing backup in general. And we don't even know how strong he is. Yeah. We don't even know how strong he is. But yeah, I, I just don't like that. I feel like we just kind of got left out. Like, we didn't have no cliffhanger going, going to the next. Maybe we're going to get like a little trail or something, but I, they could have added it to the end or something. Yeah. Like, yeah, the moments that happened were great. I'm not I'm not take, taking that away from that. The moments were great. Um, everybody being survived or pretty much surviving, this was, that was dope. Her healing everybody was dope. The backstory on the, on the I don't want to call them twins, but the brother and sister was dope. That's cool and all. I still needed more. I need a little bit more. Yeah. And also, like, the master, like, being able to see a glimpse of hope, finally. Mm -hmm. Not defeating the Hashira for, like, what, 200 years? And he was mm -hmm. just like, bruh, it's, it's, things is changing now. This is the first time in years that he's seeing that stuff is going to change. And it's going to go back to Muzan. You know he mad. He called this meeting already. He, he actually starting to grow on me because I always thought he was like an undercover snake. Just the way he looked and his character design, I ain't trust him. Yeah. But now I'm like, I like him now. Yeah. He cool peoples. 
I think they showed us another one of the upper ranks, man, from the backstory. Yeah. Who, who's so up, that one got to be higher now. The upper six that we saw probably took his spot. He probably rose up the ranks. Who was that? Who was that guy? Could he have been number one? Yeah. If he is, man. I don't, know. What is it? I don't like that little hat, little thing you got on top. It look like it's a hat. But I, but I know it's his hair. But yeah, look, look, look the weird. Fire, man. Oh, overall, overall. Still got to give this season an uh, S. Uh, season oh, yeah. two. This season was just a joy to watch. Beautiful, fire, crazy, climatic. It was, it was, it was dope. I enjoyed it. If I you, it. if you tell somebody to watch this season, will you tell them to watch it at the very beginning of the Mugen Train arc? Yeah. If they haven't seen the Mugen Train arc, definitely watch it. that. Would you tell them to watch the movie, or would you tell them just to watch the whole season? I just tell them to watch the whole season because it kind of flows. Yeah. It flows, and then you know, that's just goaded. Like if we hadn't seen the movie, bro, and we just got it been, this, would have been crazy. Yeah, it would have been the craziest season. That would have been like too. That would have been too much heat. This would have been better than the first season. If you did not watch the movie Movie Train, second season is better than the first season, hands down, because you got so many crazy moments. You have literally, bro, technically two seasons worth from one. But yeah. I just wish that movie part, the movie, the movie to me just messed up the whole vibe to me, like the chronological vibe. But it happened to happen, so I'm leaving it alone. I'm waiting for season three. We need some more from that. Thanks, man. Hey, hope y'all enjoyed it, man. Let us know how y'all liked it, and um, yeah, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And make sure I take these videos out on our Patreon before you put them on YouTube. Thanks. I'm checking out. Peace. Peace.